32 spoon plugs sold in 13, 13 days. days. Wow. Only in Chicago. Only in Chicago. <laughs> Boy, look at this display. Now, this is the new museum, right? This or is a display. Display, not a museum. <laughs> This is, boy, this is a big room. It, it is. Oh, yeah, it's a big room. Look at the size of this. He's got his rods up here. Yes, this, it's all tagged, as you can see. Okay, the Green Garcia Ambassador, you see? Oh, okay. And from that's, the 40s and 50s, the that's the casting rod. Yeah. And then you see the old, old casting reel with the Langley trolling reel. The square casting rod. Oh, yeah. Below that is Tom Coleman stuff. Okay. See, then we moved into the we moved into the late '60s and uh, well, we moved into the '60s and '70s with the gray rods. See the gray casting rod, mm -hmm. the trolling rod. Okay. And also oh, yeah. the brown ones that uh, were made for the California promotion. Huh. And that brings us back down to the present day stuff, you know. To the present day, yeah. Look at the, the pictures and. This is all the promoters, uh, many pictures from the Chicago promotion with Johnny Boy and Don Nichols and their wives. Mm hmm. And Buck. Wow. Uh, these are some of them we got. We got some of the books that are put, put together. But these are all put together like this. Mm -hmm. We don't have it in here. But I'll f probably undo it when I get rid of it. But it's, it's These all, are all the old fishing news. These are the news. All the fishing news. Fishing oh, news. Yeah. And then our first paper that oh, we had, FCA, yes. Fishing Consultants of America. Okay. Now, I don't remember that one. Okay. No, you probably haven't seen it. Huh. Okay. Well, you like to see this over here. Here's that. We got a lot of stuff in here like this. Like this see? These are some of the drawings that you made? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's nice. You don't see your stuff work. that worked. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. You got no, a lot. Oh, yeah, it, it's, uh, it's uh, very, in other words, that hole took a lot of work. Yes, yes, a lot of work. See? So, see? that's great. See? Nobody knows how. They will never will know. How much work, How much work you did on it, right. Yeah. That's for sure. Well, this is really nice, Mr. Perry. Well, we didn't have Gosh. any, the only, Jerry and I, and, and, and he helped quite. Jerry and Terry, I understand they did a lot of work. Yeah. That's great. We moved in the black and whites with the Tennessee Spoon Plugging Club. Oh, yeah, from... Uh, Tom Coleman's group, yeah. Then we move into the color pictures, you know, in later, later pictures. Okay, is this into the, the uh, jamboree and things? Or not quite into well, that? Sort of, but well, now. It, it is. It's kind of mixed up. Kind of mixed yeah. up, okay. Then we got John and... and oh, uh, look at some yeah, of those with John. Those, those, uh, those huge smallmouths. Small small yeah, yeah. Oh, it's man. The picture of John with his muskie. You got to see this. <laughs> yeah, that yeah. One. John with his muskie? Yeah. That's a tiger muskie, isn't it? Wasn't that a uh, I think that's a few years old. I yes. I found that in an old file of letters. <laughs> and so I thought, well, we got to put that out. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's neat. That's neat. Ted, that's, oh, that's a nice small one with Ted there. Boy. Nice, nice fish. We've tried to put signs on all of them, but mm -hmm. we haven't all been able to finish yeah, them. Yeah, there's a lot of work to that. Oh, that's nice. Gosh. Now, these are all the stripers we've been catching out of the road, the bigger ones that we okay. took pictures of, not the smaller ones, but the wow. bigger ones. Look at the size the of biggest those. One, the biggest one was caught by Bassett Smith's wife, Linda. Oh. 30, 32 pounds, 4 ounces. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, isn't that something? That's amazing. Oh. <laughs> What a striper. Special herb for her. Oh, you see how right. big these fish are. Right. Special for her. Mm -hmm. and this is all Florida stuff. Florida up here. I heard Kramer's here. Okay. This stuff. Gosh, look at all those. Mm -hmm. That's Scott. That's Scotty with his Scott Jenkins with his uh, two big Oh, bags. yeah. Ooh, look at the size of those. They're on the wall over there when we get to it. Okay. And uh, this is a combination of the Northeast 
spoon pluggers, and for some reason, Wally Kulikowski got, I got in, in there. there. Oh, uh, just okay. Well, <laughs> Debbie's in there. Yeah, okay. Debbie, yeah. 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 These uh, spoon pluggers up there, Jim Mason and then Barry and Tammy. Oh, yeah. Okay. Do they have a club up there? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, and this is uh, some of the northern Illinois stuff. This is Vic's girlfriend, Judy. They caught a bunch of big muskies down there. Oh, yeah. Crab, yeah that's Chris, isn't that Chris? That's Chris, and this is Chris down here, Chris, too, with a right. big one. He really gets them. Uh, and uh, Je that's Jerry with his kids. And that's the big striper Vic caught when he was down here last year. Oh, man. 24-14. Oh, wow. Yeah. And this guy's name is Chase with a big yeah, ass. Oh, I heard of him, but yeah, he, he heard of Chase with a big ass. This guy here, he gets in every, he's on every sheet. <laughs> every you know sheet. what I'm talking about? I got sick of looking at him. Yeah, he gets too much. <laughs> here he is right here. Okay. Okay. And we've got some of your lucker hunters. You can see yeah. there's Don. Yeah, Don. And okay. And then we got some guys from Minnesota. Those pictures were so mixed up that okay. I couldn't really. Jim and Billy with you. Okay. Oh, yeah. Jim and Billy. Yeah, that's Jim and Billy. Okay. That's great. Yeah. And here's the guy, Harold. No, we don't told you it was up in Hoover's oh. all the time. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah he came back. Me. Yeah, he came yeah. back yeah. after yeah. last year. Yeah. yeah. Let, me get, let me get this letter out of the way. Hey, you're yeah. all right. Well, we don't yeah. need it. We're, we're done. And then, uh, just the other day, they got a picture from uh, Phil Pot. He's an old time spoon plugger from Minnesota. I've heard of him. Yeah. Over oh my 50 God. inches. Wow. Look at the size of that thing. That's Ooh, that's big it. Fish. 50 wow. inch. When Bales says anything about his muskie, you just tell him, we don't even want to hear about yeah. it. We don't even want to hear about <laughs> it. When, when you get one over 50 inches, come and talk to come us. Come and talk it. to us, right. We got a 50 incher hanging there. On the wow. And, uh, so then we move down the line here. Uh, got some guys from Ohio, some guys from, well, this, this is Steve's brother with a big catfish. Cat oh, yeah. Cooper. Is that a paddlefish up there? That's a paddlefish. That's Gallagher, Gerald Gallagher. Did that uh, smack a spoon plug? I don't know how he caught it. I that sure know. looks like a, those are funny looking he said, fish. He said a spoonbill cat. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll be darned. Never caught one of those. Well, here's a whole Chase Kleinstecker thing again. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. With that silly hat on it. That silly hat. I like that silly hat, Chase. <laughs> Keeps the sun like off it. me. That's just That's saying. Exactly right. <laughs> saying that. There's oh, yeah. another whole Chase over there, too. Over there, okay. Yeah. That's enough. <laughs> <laughs> And this is uh, Johnny Boy and Don Nichols in their later years. You know, you saw them oh, in their yeah. early years mm -hmm. over there. This is the way they are now, of course. Getting old like the rest of us. And then we have Harold Eaton's first school of bass from a casting position, Ooh. 1972. Wow. 72? <laughs> yeah. I was just starting out in, in spoon plugging around 72 or 73. You were already into it, man. Then we have Harold Eaton framed up here. Oh, yeah, those are some nice ones. Yeah. Oh, Chase used with me when I caught that big bass in Crab Orchard. Oh, yeah, that's right. And uh, that was a nice one. That was Ron Downhauer up mm -hmm. here. Ron and his wife down here. Mm -hmm. She's the sweetest little thing. She says, she says she, he asked her to go. You understand what I mean? Mm -hmm. So she says, okay, I'll go with you. <laughs> she said, but I want to leave whenever, you know. And he says, you can leave whenever you want to. You know, he said, but just go on out there and try it. So he takes her out there, takes her out on Wiley and up by the smokestacks. You know what I'm talking about here. Yeah. He makes a couple of trolling passes with wire, and she catches these two fish. She says, I've had enough. I'm ready to go. Now I see what it's all about. <laughs> oh, gee. <laughs> <laughs> she was serious. <laughs> you know, this is a good spoon plugger. One of my students, Len Bell from South Carolina. Oh, yeah. yeah. He is a good one. There's some wintertime striper fish, and you can see the clothes we got on. Ooh. You know. You don't like to put those heavy clothes on, do you? No, sir. You like that, we, co that warm weather. It's cold out there. <laughs> okay. Look at this, uh, the big coat. See what oh, I mean? Yeah. Yes. Insulated suit. There's Harold again with some fish. Uh, him and Steve, where we were all fishing oh, yeah. together on uh, Lake Road, his. Okay. Wow. And then uh, this is, uh, we got berries in here. But this is most of the students that came down, you know. Mm -hmm. I don't know why they put that thing up. But they, wow. I'm all over that thing. But this here, uh, 
This is that big bass I caught when I was with Zaborny, that eight pounder. Oh yeah. Boy, that's a nice amazing. fish. Yeah, amazing. What a what an amazing thing that was. This kid here, look at the look on his face. He's from Kentucky. See him? Mm -hmm. That's the biggest bass he ever caught in his life. You know what I mean? Look at the look on his face. He was ecstatic. Now, those are a bunch of students, and this is this okay. is my man Trampus Johnson from Oklahoma, and he he's really getting to be a good spoon. Good. Oh. Uh, Trampus. He was driving 88 miles to buy spoon plugs. He didn't know that there was a Buck's Base or what. He was oh. driving to, to Oklahoma City from where he lived. 88 miles. 88 miles. <laughs> Talk about a faithful. And there, of course, is Chase. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. I told you he's on everything. I can't. That's Don and Hickory. Yeah. Yeah, I remember that. Okay. You had a better hand on that day. Yeah, I had a better hand. I try to I get know. the best. I know. Now, this is the. Some of the drawings. That this you is did. some of the material. Okay? Material, the okay. Material, you know, and there's some over there. I, I got it more okay. organized over there. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And the good thing about it is he talks about it, this this information, so on and so forth. How would you go about getting this information? What he's done differently now is Buck's comments. Then he talks about it. Ah. You see what I mean? It's Buck's comments. And yeah. if you look over there, they're all hanging there with his comments after the drawing. Mm -hmm. Okay. That might be another good publication for him. Yeah, yeah, it could be. Because he's got his comments left and right on Sure, it. and that's important, you know, to... to yes, it is, yeah. right there. Let's see, when was that written? 1971, January 26, 1971. And that, they were your students back then? Yeah, I had a husband and wife class. I, I guess it was in the early 70s was when the class wow, was. So my memory that. is terrible, you know. Look at that catch. Yeah, oh yeah, they... Did a job. Yeah. Wow. Okay, from the plant here. Okay. Uh, this is all the hats from all the different spoon plugging clubs. You can see a oh. Hunter hat up there. Okay. Okay, and Buck with some bass for a clerk from one of the stores in Minnesota. This is where, um, where uh, see, 1964, 30 people working here. In this, in, in the, the factory? In the factory. Yeah. Oh, wow. I think at one time that they had about a hundred that they were running three shifts right, you know, back in the Yes, and they were just making spoon plugs, those 30 people? Oh, yeah. Wow. This is a catch that Buck and I made a couple years ago before they moved here. Okay, this is in front of the old place. Oh, yeah. Nice. Scott, when he was real young, See him? <laughs> Real, yeah. You're getting old too. You're getting old too, huh? Yeah. Got Danny Collardo's in here. And, okay. Uh, I don't know if you're on there, Chase. <laughs> Probably <laughs> not. Hard enough. I wanted to blow this picture up, but we never got around to it. We were going to blow that up. Oh, wow. Look at the size of that catfish. Yeah. Oh, yeah. These are nice. Gosh. This is some more stuff here. You know, and this is, uh, here's Bart Allen and his son, Corey. And oh, this yeah. is Brian Cox. There's Chase. <laughs> there we <laughs> He's go. He's here again. Yeah, yeah Crab there Orchard. Yeah, well, you were with me when we did that one. Yeah, I weren't, I weren't you, Harold? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You guys yeah, were together. You recognize that down there with that uh, big old fish up there? <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> the one of the crazy years. The historical stuff, okay? Oh, yeah. All right. This is the first ever green book. And Jerry, you figured that was about 1948? Green book? I mean, he didn't... The, this was the first booklet. booklet. The first booklet. Yeah, okay. Here, let me show you what it looked like over here. Oh, so, yeah. yeah. Here it is, 25. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. These when And I these are the pages. That kind of gives you, yeah. Okay. This is a... Kind of gives you a history around... These the are the pages in line here. Yes. Right down the line here. Okay. okay. All right. Wow. Except for this last one. Okay, now listen to this yeah. one. Harold, you'll love this. Okay? The spin plug. For a spinning rod and fly rod. Now, wait till I show you this stuff, okay? Now, this you see all the prices here and everything and what was offered at that particular time. Okay? Mm -hmm. This is later now. Mm -hmm. Even now it's later, okay? Wow. That spin plug, that was the 300? No. Or wasn't there one? Uh... No. No. 
right here. Well, yes, if you take the 300. No, 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 the spin fly's different. You oh. See, the spin fly? Yeah. The spin fly. Oh. And the poppers for bass and trout, you'll see them in the, in, I didn't in know. the case. Okay? That's interesting. And the spin plug, fly rod. Oh, wow. Dollar twenty-five. <laughs> Seventy-five cents. <laughs> <laughs> what can you buy for seventy-five cents nowadays? <laughs> you huh? can't even buy a snap. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Gosh, that goes way back. Oh, this yeah. is really nice. This is when he made the surface lure, the weedless lure, the LSD spoon, and the SJ. See him in the shadow box? Okay. Mm -hmm. Those are nine hundreds. That was prior to the seven hundred. Okay, the new seven hundred. Three ring two hundreds. Oh, okay. Oh, you could plug that up for me. These are all. Uh, oh, do you mean the light? Yeah. yeah. He might get those films. I'm not going nowhere near. Oh <laughs> yeah, hand polished. Shape brass and silver. We didn't couldn't put enough copper together. Huh. This down here is the way the colors were made in order, starting from the left to the right. Okay. Hmm. Okay, in other words, the silver was first, and then the Don Nichols yeah, yellow yeah, was last. He has a famous gold shiner. There's the gold shiner. I can figure it out. I love that color. That's a gold <laughs> shiner. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Gosh. And down here is that 300L. Okay, they're made out of aluminum. See them down there? Those, yeah, there's four or five of them. And we could only find one 300M. See it? Little 500 fly rod, spinning rod stuff. Oh, that's the 300M. That, yeah, that right, one right there, there, and this is a 300L. M meaning what? You got me. Oh, okay. But that now, what, how was that different from the 300L? Made out of aluminum in real light. There's one 300L in there. Oh, okay. It's made out of thinner metal. And thinner metal. Nickel, copper, and brass. Okay, thinner metal. Thinner yeah. metal. This okay. is aluminum up here. These are aluminum. Yeah. Wow. And these are hand polished lures. Now up that's here. pretty much the same size as a 500 now, isn't it? Yeah, same thing. Okay. Same size. Here's the Spin fly in the poppers, uh, but you can make. Oh, yeah. I'll be done. Jerry says, what are these things? I says, I know where those are. <laughs> <laughs> he says, you got some. I said, I think you're kidding. I thought they were seen. So. Now, the popper is that big one down there? Yeah, the, the fly rod like... popper, yeah. Oh. See, Three wing one. Okay, I have two one wing, of those. Two hundreds, and I bet you something Harold never saw before. Oh, there's, yeah. five. there's a five pack. Did you ever see a two ring 400, Harold? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Right no. there. Two ring 400s, two ring 250s. No. Mm -mm. This is the uh, orange pack. Uh -huh. This is the orange one, yes. Yeah. Right. Well, the I... boxes used to be orange. Well, there was a. Way back. Did you? Individual uh... boxes. Okay, in other words, you I've had seen a... some of those. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Okay. This one was an 809. I'll be darned. Yeah, I had never seen. Uh, one this size until Tom got that. Yeah, hold on, just one jiffy. See, that was a one, two, three, four, five. Mm -hmm. That was a That's six one, one made. Huh. Six color made. Wow. Okay. The S series, and you got a couple SJs in with it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. And they sponsored it, and this male lure was sent with the Reader Digest with the story. Just Mail. this way. That was Mail the, lure. That was, was the packaging. At 500, they sent them. Now, the Reader's Digest, I didn't know they had any story in Reader's oh, yeah. Digest. Oh, yeah. What, what issue was that? Actually, it was an ad for their uh, motor. For Avenrude Motors? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. And, but they had a spoon plug in it? Uh, yeah. Female it lure? It went with it. Uh, I'll be darned. You don't know have the year of that, do you? Or the 1962, Jer? Does it say on the ad there? Oh. Okay. So this is. Oh yeah, this is Buck's. Uh, There's a letter from Mr. and Mrs. Dole. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ronald Reagan. And, yeah. Well, that's the, from the Chicago promotion that. that uh, yeah. Up there, they had. Or Illinois, I think there was a thing going in Illinois yeah. about the course that he was given. Boy, that look at that. Oh yeah. This is a governor. This is Jesse Helms, governor of North Carolina. Fishing oh. With Buck. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'll be there. And let's see, we got the, a lot of good stuff in there. 
lot you of know who this bill is? A lot Chase? of politicians. No, who's that? That's Buck. That's Buck? Yes, yes, it is. Buck. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, I didn't I never saw that, that one. That was just a few yeah, years ago. I never saw that one. That was just a few years ago. <laughs> That's neat. That wasn't long ago. <laughs> no, it was a few years ago. Yeah. Now, did your dad have a, a I record didn't, bass? I didn't do all this work for nothing. No, that's right. Didn't your dad have a record bass for uh, that was uh, for, for the Perry? state? No. Uh, that or was George Perry. But George Perry. Yeah. yeah. He, was, he was in Georgia, from Georgia. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I, I didn't know if that was a relative of yours or not. No. Oh, yeah. Look at the colors over here. You know what I mean? mm. This wow. is uh, some history in here, too. Oh, this yeah. Is the, this is the, uh, the rooster tail. Uh, the rooster tail he used to make. Okay. Oh yeah. You see some roosters are hanging up on here too. They're in pretty yeah. good shape. And this is all of them. You know what I mean? The SJ. SJs. Okay. Now what's that big silver one over there? Though? That's the LSD over. That That's came in several different sizes. Okay, wow. which you'll see here in a minute. I caught some awful big fish on that thing. Yeah. And this is the first seven hundreds. First 700s? Yes. My the, gosh, that's a big salt, lure. Salt water stuff, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Look at the size of that. Okay. You got a lot of history right there. Yes. I'm telling you. And over here is a lot of reels. Now, uh, pen. They're, the true temper reel is right here. Okay. See it? Okay. True temper, true temper, and then we get into this here. That, those are just some reels he used to troll with. Mm -hmm. This is oh. mine from that went all through the years of working with him. Oh, casting. A, yeah, casting reel. Okay. Okay. And then the one that we're the most proud of is this one here. This shadow box right here. Look at Ooh. this. That's got the SJs in it, the S series lures, and you see that LSD, how many different sizes it came in. Oh my in. gosh. See? How do you like that? That's pretty. A lot of history there. That's something. A lot That's of history nice. there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like that one. That's a this good one. This is a, a tool made by Bucks, Bucks Bates. Well, you know, made by here. What did they do with it? It was for the garden club. It was for uh, tending your little pot. You know, oh, okay. <laughs> so that was one thing they manufactured here. Yeah. And you, you see what you're shooting film with. This is what we used to shoot the film with. <laughs> now that would be a little tougher. Yeah, see, well, you'll wind it up. <laughs> Winding it up. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yes, sir. In here. Yeah. That's your, uh, at the... Yeah, not only this, but it, it gave me this other sort of stuff that we... You have to explain what it is. Mm -hmm. It's all... Hmm. Uh, oh, very nice. Look at these... Fish pictures too. And you, you got to remember now, there's only about two guys did all this. That's right. Yes, sir. That's right. And it worked. It worked me to death. <laughs> well, it's worth it. This is really a nice display. This is really nice. Oh, wow. Those are. <laughs> Those are big now. That's the wow! Look at that walleye. Yeah, Jerry. Jerry, how big? How big did that go, Jerry? Eleven and a half pounds. Oh my gosh. Up in um, Rainy Lake in uh, Canada. In Canada. Wow. Oh, that's Those are huge. Yeah. A little commotion right Oh here. yeah. Okay. Okay. Chase, I know oh, I got something I from you here. Right here. Something you wrote. Oh. You got a lot of. A lot of this is from way back, isn't it? Yes. Mm -hmm. A lot of those pictures are from way back. We just had so many pictures, we had to hang them up. Yeah. Yeah. As Vic at a younger day. Oh yeah. yeah. That was oh, from Lake Apopka. Did you show yeah. Vic over there on the other wall? Oh you? yeah. Yeah, I took him at a younger day. Yeah, they look over and he's little little hole there. That's what oh, I was. Yeah. <laughs> Buck, he was quite a football player out here. Yeah. Most valuable player, 1936. 
Mr. Shore with the puppy bugs and stuff that he made. made when he was coming out. This is all his football history over oh, here. Oh, okay. Okay. Wow. And there's some more of the popping bugs and stuff that popping he made. Popping bugs that he made, okay. And the depth finder's down under there. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Here's the most valuable football player, Lenore Ryan College, now, 1936. Now, that was a fancy, hmm. uh, you know, trophy. That was the biggest trophy that the L.I. ever gave. Isn't that something? That's great. <laughs> Okay, that's that's what size is that? <laughs> that's a big one. That's a conversation. A conversation piece. spoon plug. <laughs> that's a conversation <laughs> piece. <laughs> that's neat. All the newspaper articles. Wow. I like the artwork. He used to use and we used to use for the classes. Okay. Before we had all that printed material, you know. We the artwork that. before the. Uh, oh, yeah. And overlays on here. God. Did you know that uh, some of these guys are. Uh, That's Bobby Jones up Bobby there. Bobby Jones, yeah. And Joe okay. Reese. I didn't have a picture of Sammy Sneed. I thought I did, but it turned out to be somebody else. Yeah. He did a. He did a. They're well, the he old timers. Madeline Bass. Yeah. That's the history. Yes. Now that's a pretty nice fish there, Mr. Perry. Yeah, Sixteen saw, pound I bass. Caught a lot of those. I did. You caught a lot I in that lot in that size? Yeah, I caught a lot of those fish. Sixteen pounds, yeah, wow. That was about the biggest I caught. That is a yeah. huge fish. Sixteen pounds. Sixteen pounds. <laughs> Some good catches. That's your dad there. Yeah. Lake James. Okay. He fishing in Lake James. And that was the fish he caught. And I was just a youngster. Let's see. I don't know what age. You said he was, then, you were talking so much, he told you to be quiet. Is that right? 1928. 1928. Yeah. You said, in your material, you said he was talking, you were talking so much, he told you to be quiet. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that's great. I got a lot of good goodies yes. in there, boy. You got it. Yes, sir. The way the fish are set. Well, that was, that that one's got to that would be turned around. But that whole thing is this features, features mm -hmm. on the bottom. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. See, it just keeps going. Mm -hmm. Different way that the fish hit. The way that you're going to catch them. And all the way through. Structure situation. See? It just goes on and on. And a crooked weed line. Mm -hmm. I put the whole works in there. If you don't think that took some work. This thing. Mm -hmm. And look, you ain't seen nothing yet. Look. Mm -hmm. I put that thing together. And you say, well, it's waiting. You. Uh -huh. That we have hanging on the wall. Okay. okay. Mm hmm. He started the modern era of fishing. Mm hmm. Know. So this is a rack of, of different uh, articles yeah, and different things? Yeah, articles. Uh, one of them came out in southern. Living here. Uh huh. Let's see what this one is. Oh yeah, father of structure. Kind of like history. Yeah, that's nice. Very nice. Okay. It's nice to have them preserved like that. Yeah. 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 Then people can take a look at them and not not hurt them because they're all. This is just a bunch of people catching fish. And various newspaper stories. Well, you got some, you got to have put down some written material. You got out hmm. some material. And so, this oh, way yeah. to do written material for people is in like, in the folder like this. Right. Yeah, I'm that's an old nice. school teacher. <laughs> yeah. 
That's Terry's uh, Northern 17 and a half pound from Lake Tippy Canoe. All right, nice I fish. I try to do those everything, to every, try to get everybody. Yeah. But sometimes I miss them. <laughs> yeah. And Terry's good at it too. Oh, yeah. The biggest bass you've ever caught up north? Up north, yeah. How big does that go? It was seven, Ooh, seven something. Seven pounds, wow. Yeah. That, that's about 45 minutes from where I lived in McHenry. Huh. White water. Because it was in 1947. No, and that was a 100 with three rings? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> On the nickel, colors nickel.